The guy who owns this is a hero because he is holding out. People have been trying to get rid of him for years. Really? You know, it's not as you know fancy. They were trying to make 72nd Street. Oh, like, no. Yeah. See, I don't like that. I love but this part. Whoever this guy is, he's a hero. What up, friends? Come on, Mount Kay Vegan. It's A.N. Mike. What's good, everybody? We're currently in Manhattan, 72nd Street in Amsterdam. We're going to show you guys Green's Papaya. Let's go take a look. Let's go. Here to New York City, you have to come here because the dogs are really, really good. They're, they're the best dogs I've ever had, and also the price is amazing. Now, a lot of people have different takes on how they want to have their hot dog. People like only mustard in it, but I love their sauerkraut. The first bite that you have, that casing is gonna have that crisp, crisp taste. Let's see. Mm -hmm. So good, guys. Is already enjoying hers and I'm gonna get back to this a little bit and kind of explain <laughs> she's already eating now this is really not much to this place it's something that's very reminiscent to back in the days I spent a lot of my time in high school coming up here because it was very cheap to kind of grab food and eat but the one thing that's very important to to note is that the hot dog itself has like a coating on it it's very crispy and tender on the inside so I'm gonna dive into mine and let you know what I think Eat, man. Now this place is open 24-7, it gets packed, it is on 72nd Street, a lot of people don't tend to travel this far if you are a tourist in New York, but they did open one in Times Square, so you can definitely check it out over there. When you come here, with the price you're going to feel like it's easy to order more than you need, but you really don't. And the, the key to the whole thing is just the hot dog really, the bread is just normal, the sauerkraut's there, a lot of flavor packed into the hot dog itself. Let me open this up so you can see. You see how it's cooked a little bit, where there's like a casing on it? The recession special is always the best go-to because you get two dogs and you get a drink. I moved to this neighborhood to eat here in 1982. Well, sort of accidentally, but I came down here to have a hot dog and found an apartment. But you guys really know how to order. You guys know it. She was saying with the onions and the sauerkraut, that's the only way to order it. I think it was 75 cents for a long time. Three, four years. I'm not gonna say expensive because it's a bargain at any price. Even it was cheap even for the time. Like 75 cents was cheap. This is a classic New York hot dog, which is derived from like a kosher hot dog. So it's all beef. And it's got a snap to it. It's got the, the skin. Like a New York hot dog is the snap of the skin. They sell these at the grocery store. We buy them, I eat them at home. It's actually papaya king, which is the basic same thing. Another interesting thing, the people behind the counter. Every few years, the ethnicity changed. A few years ago, it was East or West African immigrants. Oh, wow. like before that, I forget where they were from. That's interesting. So you think they're changing ownership, but keeping no, the brand? No, it's a Greek owner. It's a Greek, Greek owner. owner. A lot of people always say that New Yorkers are always on the move, they're very unfriendly, and everyone's very welcoming. Like this dude, completely had a conversation, gave us some dope history about the place. So this is pretty cool. She's still eating. I haven't even gotten my, um, my second piece you guys can see this became more than just a vlog or just us talking about food it's about meeting people dining with people who knows That's what it is. you know if you didn't eat already who would even offer now they're also known for their drinks they have like papaya drinks pina coladas they have a bunch of drinks for you to taste a lot of tropical flavors and it's really good too Eating standing up, by the way, I forgot to mention that. Yeah. I'm not sitting down. No need to. A lot of times people are in and out here. You just grab your dogs, you're out of here in less than five minutes. When we go riding, we always come out here, right? That's another spot we always come to. We just park real quick outside and then come in here, grab a dog or two. You're good to go. Here's another interesting fact. I know you guys are looking at the place. It looks very simple. All about the food. Nothing very complicated. Huge shout out to supporting small businesses. The owner actually supports minorities and stuff like that and try to give work to people. So it's all about the food. Very cheap and friendly. So just come in and grab yours. If you're in New York and you don't stop here and have a hot dog, you're a fool. We absolutely love the hot dogs at Great Sapayo. I highly recommend it. I know Mike recommends it as well. If you can't venture off to 72nd Street, they do have a new location in Times Square, so you can check it out over there. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it that thumbs up. Thumbs up. Drop a comment down below. Down below. And let me know if you've ever had Great Sapayo before. I know we have. <laughs> as always, thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye, salamat. Another piece of trivia, the movie The Warrior. 
Brothers, and there's I a scene that takes place. It's like right over there. See, we're gonna have to rent it now. In the movie, it they say it's 96th Street, but it's really here. And if you do slow motion, you can see this, and you can see that cafe on the corner. It's a different name of the bar, but this place is here. Interesting. Oh, I appreciate you doing this with us. That's great. I appreciate you doing it. <laughs> I always so am like want these guys to have more business. Yeah, you know? absolutely. I'm doing my best. Aww, thank you thank so you. much. Please check Take out your care. channel. I'm, I'm definitely checking right. out your channel. Thank you so much again. All right, thank see you, ya. Mark.